Digging Haman's Kral out of its water crisis hinges on getting the Royval wastewater treatment plant up and running. But as Tswane MMC for Utilities and Operations, Temba Fossi, says this could take years. Four billion rand has been set aside to complete the critical project in an area that's seen the worst of the ongoing cholera outbreak. Work at the plant stalled due to financial constraints. ENCA reporter Pula Lechwiti Jones has more. This is the timber purification plant that services the Hamanskral area. It has tested negative for traces of the cholera bacteria. But for this plant to do its job, the Royval wastewater treatment plant has to be fully functional. Now what then happens? Water from then on, obviously there's things that you and me cannot see with our naked eye which are those microbes, germs, and all of those things. They need to be cleaned and released into a, a pipe all the way through the river up until to Temba Waste Water Treatment Plant. Now, when you get here, it is only water. Now, this is where we purify our water for our people to be able to ingest it. This is the importance of making sure that this works, but this won't work when the first filter, which is Royval Waste Water Treatment Plant, is not sorted out. So it starts there and then it comes here and then eventually to our residents they can be able to access through their communal tabs. Royval is the largest plant in Tuane, processing about 45% of the city's wastewater. Given the plant's central role in keeping the city's water safe to consume, Forsy says the Water and Sanitation Department, as well as the municipality, is prioritizing its completion. Let me rather actually call it a partnership between City of Tuane and National um, 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 Government and National Treasury DBSA also. Um, we've come out with um, mitigating um, um, solutions where we can, um, uh, we will be installing a package plant in the uh, Tlebkhat uh, water treatment plant where we would be providing water now by March 2024 to the very same residents to make sure that they have potable water whilst we are still trying to um, sort out um, rival. Water expert Dr. Ferial Adam says municipalities need to start taking the issue of maintaining water infrastructure seriously. We know that uh, even with you know pipes and um, wastewater treatment works that we're seeing right now, it's in a dire state. And so municipalities need to spend at least six to eight percent on of the cost of the asset on in terms of maintenance and we know that many of them are not even close to that if there's even one municipality that comes to about one percent it would be a miracle the Tuani municipality says it's working around the clock to detect the source of contamination Hule Lichwiti Jones Hamanskral in the north of Tuane.